Hello, everybody. I'm KC from Doc PC. Uh, hey, guys, we're back to check out another boat. We're going to be checking out another Boston Whaler boat, the uh, 380 uh, Realm boat. Uh, so let's go jump onto the site and start checking it out. The Realm comes in two models. It comes in the uh, 350, uh, which is a 35 footer, and 380, which is a 38 footer. So we're going to jump in and have a look at the 38 footer. Take a look at that nice looking board. I wouldn't mind having that sitting on my driveway. <laughs> I wonder if they throw in those uh, surfboards, you know. I would hope they would. Oh, I think they probably would, eh? <laughs> this one's really nice outfitted. You got your radar bar here, you got your night vision, you got your spotlight. It's it's one nice looking boat. Let's go down and check out a few pictures of this one. That looks, that's looking pretty good sitting there. Got some nice skylights up top there. It's a pretty nice view of the boat there. Take a look at that helm. We got uh, three 16 inch monitors here, all your flip switches. This is my favorite spot on the boat. I really like that. That's looking pretty good there, tied up to the dock. They must be in there having dinner at the uh, 1500 South. <laughs> You got some nice uh, water lighting here and interior lighting. It's looking pretty good. This one has a really nice uh, fridge uh, uh, cooler area. The uh, seat pops up and then you can open up the big door on the refrigerator cooler. Or when it's closed, you can open up the smaller door. So you got lots of space in there for, star for storing good food. It looks like the uh, big Boston Whaler. It looks like one of the smaller Boston Whalers sitting behind it. Take a look at that nice bow rider up here. Nice. There is a table here that does pop up, but uh, when you're not using the table, you pop her down. They got all this padding in here. It'd be a run really nice ride here. Take a look at all those drink holders and nice accent lighting. I wouldn't mind riding up there. <laughs> it's looking pretty good. Well, let's go down and check the specs of this boat out. The overall length of this one is 38 feet. The beam is 11 foot 8, so that's a pretty beamy boat. The dry weight is 1,700 pounds. And then you throw in your four outboards and you liquid it all up and you're up to 23,500 pounds. It's a little bit of a hefty weighter. Fuel on board is 1,684 liters. You also have another fuel, fuel tank, which is diesel, uh, which is 75 liters. And you have a wastewater tank of 37 liters and a freshwater tank of 208 liters. So that's a pretty good amount of fresh water to keep you going for a weekend out on the water. And you've got two engine configurations. The minimum horsepower on this one is 1,200 horsepower and the maximum is 1,600. So if I was buying this boat, I'd be maxing her out with the 1,600 horsepower. So we're going to go take a virtual tour of this boat. So I'm going to do some clicking here. So I hope I don't lose you guys. <laughs> so let's see here. Yeah, I think I'm going to get it up here. Sure, a lot of clicking you got to do. So now we're in the, uh, the bow of the boat here. It looks quite uh, roomy up here. There's the table popped up. You got your nice uh, big speakers here. See so some pretty good sound in this one. And there's your drink holders. Yeah, so it's a pretty nice setup. Nice big lounger here. I wouldn't mind sitting here. And they even got the uh, sunscreen shade that you can pop out here, which is a nice touch. And the 405 has that, and the 345 also has it too. So let's see what we got up in here. This is probably the windless anchor. Yep. So really nicely compact in there and neatly stored away in there. What do we got over here? We got, uh, looks like we got some storage up front here. So looks like a lot of storage. That's pretty nice to have. <laughs> let's flip around here and this looks like there's probably storage in there. You probably store all your um, ropes in there. Now this one here has got a door here, so you can open and close this door. I think it's a little bit of a wind uh, shield too. 
This one here kind of has the uh, a three quarter windshield, so it's not a complete windshield like the 405 has. But this one is a little smaller boat. So let's pop back and have a look back here at the helm. So you got the, uh, you can kick this bolster up and you can stand up and rest against it or pop it down and you can have a nice seat there. Uh, there again, Boston Whaler does a really nice job in all their upholstery. Everything is top notch, high end. But take a look at those monitors. <laughs> Looking pretty nice. Nice drink holders here. You got your uh, bow thruster and you got your joystick over there. You got your throttles there. Uh, nice wheel. Got your radio down there. And actually, yeah, I wonder if you can have the option to put the radio up here, like the 345 and the 405 Conquest. It looks like you might have some storage up there and a few uh, indicators up here. And you got a, uh, a single. Um, a single automatic opener for vent to let some cabin air in yeah so it look, looks looking pretty good looks like these windows here you can pop them open and closed you can just tell everything is just top-notch quality built built really nice up top here is your nice big skylight you got your sun shield on there so you can uh, darken it up if you want too much light in or too much sun in got all the LEDs here which is nice for lighting up at night. So what do we got in here? Well, that's back up to the bow. We know we're already seen now. So let's flip back and go backwards. <laughs> yeah, so the helm is really nice on this one. And now we're gonna head back. Oh, here's your galley back here. You got your fridge and your freezer back here. And I believe this pops up and you can have a, there's a, uh, single electric burner in there and a sink uh, so it's pretty nice here's another seat here so lots of seating on this boat let's pull back here and, uh, this also has the uh, big uh, sunshade here this one i believe on the realms it's a hand crank and on the uh, conquest it's a power uh, push out so here's another seat of rowing here, uh, row seat. So you also can have a little pop-up table here. So that's a nice little touch there. Well, we can open this up too. Yep, yeah, so there it is. All your ears, your galley back, your sink, and everything's right in. Everything's nice, compact, really nice quality on these boats. So now we're gonna pop back. Actually, here you got your little, you got your door here that opens up to the uh, dock, which is really nice, easy access to get in and off the boat. Then you got another big, nice big bench seat back here on the stern. So on this seat here, uh, yeah, let's see here. Yeah, so you can pull this out. That's that cooler refrigerator cooler that's really nice touch in the floor here we got uh, looks like this is probably a fish hold here this is all your plumbing to the boat batteries and everything they do a really nice job everything they also got a couple of tables here that are stowed up here and pop those up on the uh, deck at the back here yeah a little bit of a party back here <laughs> yeah that pops out yep there we go those two tables there you pop them right in the floor there and then this nice big bench at the back here so that's, that's looking pretty nice i like that so let's go back out here this is just another storage area here another fish hold now i'm gonna go back here and check out these outboards Take a look at those. Now, Mercury has two different colors on this. You can either the black or the white. So, I'm thinking I'd go with the white. It's looking pretty nice. I wonder if you could actually throw on some Mercury Mercury R's on this for the extra extra punch. Probably can do that. <laughs> Got three rod holders back here, and uh, so there's always lots of rod hold rod holders on a uh, Boston Whaler. Got all your uh, power plugs over here 
So everything's really done nice. And you've got your door that opens and closes to your uh, to your engine area here. It's a pretty nice looking boat. I wouldn't mind having this boat. Well, you guys, that was the uh, the Boston Whaler uh, 380. Well, it's a really nice looking boat. Well, thanks for coming along and having a look at this boat with me. Have a great day, guys. Yeah, hey, guys. Uh, hey, thanks for coming to Doc PC and watching the video. Eh? I hope you come back and watch another one. We'll see you later, eh?